Hello, Hello I'm Milo, Milo for the for Alice Trading Com. Company. Today we're talking about touring the canals of Amsterdam. There are all sorts of ways of touring the beautiful canals of Amsterdam, and you should consider doing as many as you can. Simply walking or biking the half circles as they arc around the center of the city is one way, but you should seriously consider a boat tour. There are a few big companies that offer all sorts of lunch, dinner, and sightseeing cruises at various times of the day throughout the week. You'll find their private docks at certain points around the city. You can also check online to buy tickets and see prices. A typical tour might start near the southwestern part of the city, near Vondrel Park, and wind its way towards the central station and the ports before heading back into the city and passing through or near the Wallen, the oldest part of the city. There are many sights to see along the way other than the continual parade of Amsterdam's iconic and charming houses. For instance, look out for Vesterkirk with its prepossessing clock and bell tower. Next door is the Anne Frank House Museum. Its simple front belies the heart-wrenching history inside that you cannot miss. Your tour will float along the Amstel at one point, the river which gave Amsterdam its name. Here you will catch the interesting Nemo Science Center, great to visit with kids of any age. There is also Montelbanstraten, a tower that used to be a part of the original medieval city walls, although decorative elements were added to it in the 17th century. Shortly after is the famous Blue Bridge. While more of a gray, it replaced a famous blue wooden bridge from the 1600s and so kept its name. Through the center of the city, among others, there are three concentric arcs of canals which were built in the 17th century. The outside canal is called Prinzengracht, or Prince's Canal. The middle one is Kaisergracht, which is Emperor's Canal. And the inner one is Herrengracht, Gentleman's or Lord's Canal. The reason this is the most central is that the merchants held the power and money and were the real rulers of the city. The mayor's house is there till this day. There is much more history and sights along Amsterdam's beautiful waterways. For more of our work, check out alicetc.com.